obviously that's a great news for entrepreneurs and learners like us yes but you know it's fascinating journey over the decades you have must have faced lot of barriers which many of them which already know out of these which one was the toughest and maybe that really shook your belief at the time probably if you if you would like to mention when there was a warrant of arrest on me for something we had never done wrongly but the then chief minister was hell bent on and he was a great chief minister he did wonderful thing but for me he was hell bent in uh, trying to for no rhyme or reason and i think more important i think it was that he genuinely believed that private sector should not be in the areas of urban land business so issued a uh, warrant of arrest against me police were chasing me at that time it was like a thing you get naturally what the hell have you entered around the position for no rhyme or reason and i thought at that time i took the courage and i got the what is phase 5 today the crux of dlf i assembled the land at that time because i believed that this wind had wind will pass away but they did and i took the courage to do the right thing and if i had back down at that time which was about to naturally you can imagine Police after you for no reason. Then Gurgaon would not have been the same as it is today. And sir, my second question is: If you look at the real estate market today in India, mm -hmm. then a lot of uh, duels have come in. Bad players or the fraudulent players have been wiped wiped out of yeah. the market right now. So currently, the situation is seems to be stabilizing compared to what it was ten years ago. Yeah. What is your outlook for the market in the future? Well, my outlook is that. real estate is going to be a very big business because please understand in a democracy people want to as they grow they will be more prosperous they want to live better they want better schools for the children better medical facility but everything they want better so in that context the demand of real estate product is going to be substantially large as it is today question a will be different question would be that the purchasing power has to also commensurate increase in the hand of people now it is there today in high income or let's say top income but it has to percolate down because housing is not a question of, of a domain of high living the domain of every homeless person needs a home and government doing a constable job in providing homes to homeless but then there is the economically weak there is middle income this thing so that sector of the economy needs housing in a controlled pricing in a way which means how do you do it not easy and uh, then is a question will be that uh, how do you ensure that they have pur adequate purchasing power to buy home so it is a, it this will be the challenge in my view before the government in time to come not that there will be no demand demand is there and more india progress is more demand for housing so if if at the top level if is understood today and i'm sure with a dynamic prime minister like uh, modi ji and the government they understand and you see how he has steered the country towards the third position when you become third largest economy the demand the people will become prosperity will come but question is it has to go down the line And that is the challenge of the government. And sir, so, just one last question: Is that do you see in the future DLF becoming a overseas player as well? I mean, in terms of expansion, what is your vision for DLF? You see, I explained to when this question was asked to me earlier. Uh, in DLF, we follow a policy of doing as much as we can do it well. Means bite as much as you can chew it well. Otherwise, indigestion follows. So in DLF, the demand has always been. So at the moment, they are consolidating. They are doing as best as they can. Organizationally, they are developing. Demand in India is so huge. If you see the whole country, uh, so as you see, DLF is expanding in different areas, and demand abroad is huge. But question is, how much organization you can develop competently? to do the same job as dlf is competent doing today and that will take time so i will believe you are not jumping into outside 
you are jumping into areas where there is good demand and we can organizationally deal with it and do a competent <coughs> job. Means better than the best. That's what we follow. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.